How you doing, man? I got you another fucking pro tip, dude. I didn't say it was a secret. But uh, let me tell you how you can get more pussy, more respect, feel better about yourself, and get more done. You ready? Let me take a puff of my, my, my nice little cigar real quick before we do all that. Okay, so here's my, my pro tip that works like a champ, dude. Why don't you speak maturely and authentically? It makes for better relationships with women, co-workers, and especially customers, dude. If you want to get more money, I, I don't have a problem charging 2500 bucks anymore. See... When you let people rape you, then it's easy for you to rape others. I'll give you an example. Uh, what the hell are you talking about? Well, I you know I just spent $7,100 $7, to fix my power divider on my Kenworth. I walked in there and said, here's your seven grand. Goodbye. I spent 9000 for a transmission in my Dodge 4500. I spent 3000 for a transmission in my F-150, all within a month. I just said, here's your money, fellas. Bye. Okay, it's okay. They did a good job. I'm appreciative. So now, when I when I tell you your bill is 2,500 bucks, there you go. Have a nice day. I got no qualm saying you owe me 2,500 bucks. 3,000, 4,000, 3,000, 4,000. Hold on. Don't matter to me, homeboy. So. That's why I tell you, in, my, in your YouTube video, you know what I would do? I tell you to do start speaking authentically in your YouTube videos to your customers when you make a sale, to your children, to your mother, to a female. Let them know exactly what you require of them in the most mature way possible. You'll get respect. And you save yourself a lot of heartache. Because when you let shit slide, I don't want, I'm not letting shit slide, dude. When you let shit slide, close it down, dude. Don't let shit slide. That's, what, that's all I'm going to tell you right now. Don't let shit slide. If your woman starts getting out of line, shut it down. I'm dead serious. Yeah, shut that shit down. You, If your woman gets out of line, shut it down. Shut it down. Tell her, hey, listen. Uh, I think we're going to have to end this thing, dude. Now, I don't even think you should get to that point because you should let her know when things are in the, in, the, in, the, in the honeymoon stage. These are my rules. These are the guidelines. So she knows ahead of time what's not okay. Same thing with your workers and your children, especially, especially your children. Children and women are about the same in a way as far as it pertains to, you know, expectations. Tell them, dude, hey, Right, right when things are in your honeymoon phase, you know, those are these are things you don't cross with me, man. And hopefully they never do because you don't want to have to get rid of them. But I did. I got I got rid of my rid of both uh, every everyone. And I don't really give a fuck. To be totally honest with you, because uh oh shit, I dropped my cigar. I don't give a fuck because you know what, dude? I meant it when I said it, dude. I meant it when I said it. That's what I'm telling you. This is the video. is called Talk Authentic. Oh, shit. I guess the cigars and phones is a little bit too much here. Speak authentic. You make more money at work, dude, for the same job. Because you're serious. Everybody loves a serious person. This, women really love serious men, dude. Do you know that? A woman loves a serious man probably more than anything else, dude. I think women crave a serious man. Did you know that? They do. I can hardly think of any level-headed, mature woman that dislikes a, mat a mature man. It just doesn't happen. Women want their mind stimulated. No, oh, by the way, yeah, you can, you can fuck them all you want. On top of that, 
But really, women want their minds stimulated. So you need to be a serious man. That's how you get... That's how you can get women that you want. You can avoid women that are just trash. You got to respect yourself and go get what you know you should have. I can't think of any reason why you, why these guys are sticking around these chump ass bitches. Serious, serious, be serious. Like, like seriously, bro. You're you start talking sideways out, out the side of your mouth, dude. You you fucked up because you should let her. You should you should have figured that shit out way before you were actually living with this woman. You, should, you didn't know, dude. She just all of a sudden became a bitch. You didn't know. You just wanted companionship and pussy, and you should never put that ahead of being a mature man. And that's what I'm telling you. If you start off with it being, if you are a mature man, we're done talking. Then you can, you can entice women that you actually think are fucking awesome. Have some it's fucking common ground of awesomeness, dude. So I told you, just I just said, dude, like I told my woman again, dude, you're gone, man. I'm done. You, you're gone, dude. You're gone, dude. You're gone, dude. I'm done. Both of you fucks. I don't care if you're my son. You're gone, dude. You're fucked up, man. I'm done. I mean, I love you, whatever. We're done, dude, because I'm not doing this shit. I'm not going to live this lie, dude. You're not okay, okay? You don't want to get no better. Goodbye. I'm gone. You wanted me to leave? I'm left. I chose to leave, and you wanted me to leave. It was a mutual separation, dude. Mutually agreed upon. I'm leaving. I don't like you, motherfuckers. You don't like me, cause I don't let you get. I don't let you guys get away with murder. I'm not standing for your fucking murder shit. So therefore, it's got to go. That's unfortunate, but hey, you can always rely on your mature speech, because the doors are not closed by any means. The doors are not closed by any means, dude. None. <laughs> did you? What did you think? The doors was closed. All the doors are closed. The minute we broke up, every door is now closed. Get no, the fuck out of here, dude. Fuck those whores. Obviously, she wasn't fitting the bill. I mean, look what she did to my son. Good day.